Hey, this is Mikey with a quick video. I just want to say After Effects CC 2015 has just been released for public download. Now, you want to go and get that if you're a part of CC. Now, I do want to tell you that there is one little thing you need to be aware of when you're updating this. Um, I've already updated After Effects, so it won't update for me. Um, but under, say, speed grade right here, I haven't updated that yet. I click on Update. Um, you can see this Advanced Options. And by default, there's this remove old versions. So if you're someone like me that likes to keep every single past version of After Effects that can, then you want to make sure you go in there and uncheck that before you update. Otherwise, you're going to have to get back into Creative Cloud and delete them or and download them. Otherwise, you're going to have to get back into Creative Cloud and re-download them again. And so make sure you do that. Another reason why you want to do that, even if you don't, like to keep all the old versions is this new release is a complete overhaul of the way things work there's going to be some plugins that don't work and so just to make sure that any projects you're working on get them done now before you update or you switch over because they may not work as well or there might be some bugs because the plugins are missing and things like that we need time for all the plugin makers to do updates to the plugins so that's just a kind of a little public service announcement. There's some blog posts that I'm going to link to in the description below. I also want to say that with this release, though, it comes this Adobe Character Animator preview. Again, this is just a preview. It's not a full release. It's very, very beta. Um, but I had talked about that in another video. So if you want to see my thoughts on the CC 2015 update, I have a video. There's a link to that in the description, or you can click on the annotation. Um, thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time.